Speaking of stupid people, the Australian public are none the wiser with the situation in Manus Island and Nauru. This week, a human rights inquiry into Manus Island was shut down, and subsequently the island's been getting some pretty bad press. Why? Well, because journalists simply aren't allowed to go there. Now, to clear up some misconceptions, we have with us the head of Manus Island's 70-person PR team, Hannah Riley. Hannah, uh, long time no here. Why? Like any good resort here on the island, our residents' privacy is of the utmost importance. Plus, the investigating doctors weren't registered to practice in Papua New Guinea. They only know how to treat Australian bodies, and we're talking about completely different bodies in a totally separate country. And I mean, they're not even the same colour, and that's just not medicine. <laughs> And what about the part of the 1949 Geneva Convention that says those fleeing from conflict must be treated humanely? 1949? Get with it, Dan. We're acting on laws that don't even exist yet. Plus, we are not treating refugees inhumanely. They are called economic migrants who come here exclusively seeking better employment, which is why you see migrants getting all the best jobs. <laughs> right. Um, how do we know they're not genuine refugees? We know it in the same way that a baby's smile brings us joy or that cows can't walk downstairs, in that there is no legislative framework to back it up. <laughs> and they were out at us. Right. Um, right, well, um, how many have we processed so far? Oh, that's, um, that's a tough question, Dan. Why? In that I don't want to answer it. Right. Um, <laughs> it's none, isn't it? Yep. The PNG have also said that, that they, not human rights lawyers, are the best judges in terms of what's happening on the ground. Is that really true? Talk about squeezing the taxpayer dollar, am I right? World leaders and detectives? <coughs> Excuse me. I guess they have the human right to remain silent. <coughs> Okay, right, right but, but did, didn't Abbott defend their robust legal system? Yeah, robust like a King's Cross bouncer, and like PNG on the UNHCR Human Rights Treaty, they're not on the list of signatories. <laughs> Hannah Riley, everyone. Yeah.